The given series can be written as 1 plus in brackets 2 square plus 1 multiplied by x plus in brackets 2 cube minus 1 times x square plus in brackets 2 raised to the power 4 plus 1 times x cube plus in brackets 2 raised to the power 5 minus 1 times x raised to the power 4 plus and so on. This can be written as 1 plus in brackets 2 square plus minus square multiplied by x plus in brackets 2 cube plus minus raised to the power 3 times x square plus in brackets 2 raised to the power 4 plus minus raised to the power 4 multiplied by x raised to the power 3 plus in brackets 2 raised to the power 5 plus minus raised to the power 5 times x raised to the power 4 plus and so on. And the nth term is 2 raised to the power n plus minus raised to the power n in brackets multiplied by x raised to the power n minus 1. Therefore, the nth term of this series is equal to 2 raised to the power n plus minus raised to the power n in brackets multiplied by x raised to the power n minus 1 and this is the required answer. Now the sum to n terms of this series, let's denote it by Sn, is therefore equal to summation r going from 1 to n, 2 raised to the power r plus minus raised to the power r in brackets, multiplied by x raised to the power r minus 1. And this is equal to summation r going from 1 to n, 2 times 2 raised to the power r minus 1 times x raised to the power r minus 1 plus summation r going from 1 to n minus raised to the power r times x raised to the power r minus 1. This can be written as 2 times summation 2x raised to the power r minus 1 minus summation minus raised to the power r minus 1 times x raised to the power r minus 1. Therefore, Sn is equal to 2 times in brackets 1 plus 2x plus 2x whole square plus and so on till n terms minus in brackets 1 minus x plus x square minus x cube plus and so on till n terms. Note that both the expressions in the two square brackets are geometric series and therefore the value of Sn is equal to 2 times 1 times in brackets 1 minus 2x raised to the power n divided by 1 minus 2x minus 1 times in brackets 1 minus minus x raised to the power n divided by 1 minus minus x. And this simplifies to 2 times in brackets 1 minus 2 raised to the power n times x raised to the power n divided by 1 minus 2x minus 1 minus minus x raised to the power n divided by 1 plus x, which is the required answer. And finally, the generating function of the given series, which is the sum to infinity of the given series, let's denote it by s, is equal to the summation n going from 1 to infinity, 2 raised to the power n plus minus raised to the power n in brackets multiplied by x raised to the power n minus 1 and this is equal to 2 times summation n going from 1 to infinity 2x whole raised to the power n minus 1 minus summation n going from 1 to infinity minus x whole raised to the power n minus 1. And this can be written as 2 times in brackets 
1 plus 2x plus 2x whole square plus and so on to infinity minus in brackets 1 minus x plus x square minus x cube plus and so on to infinity. Note that the expressions inside both of the square brackets are geometric series and therefore s is equal to 2 times 1 upon 1 minus 2x minus 1 upon 1 plus x. And this is equal to 2 times 1 plus x minus in brackets 1 minus 2x divided by 1 minus 2x times 1 plus x. This is equal to 2 plus 2x minus 1 plus 2x divided by 1 minus 2x times 1 plus x. Therefore, the generating function s is equal to 1 plus 4x divided by 1 minus 2x times 1 plus x. And this is the required answer.